But we also have to talk about uh, this tropical storm. Tropical storm Beta, uh, ever so close to the Texas coastline now. In fact, let's get the latest on Beta. Uh, moving to the west, northwest at about seven miles per hour. Very slow mover. Packing winds up to 50 miles per hour, so a lot of flooding will take place right along the coastline here because of that slow movement. So it's just dumping a lot of water here, but it will move inland. And notice what happens as it does, we'll start to slide a little bit further back off toward the north and east. Now, as a tropical depression right on through Louisiana, then once it gets over toward Mississippi, it's just an area of low pressure, so the winds won't be as strong as the remnants move in our direction. But we will receive an increased chance for the rain to be around, but it looks likely uh, more so by the end of the week, toward the end of the week. Category one hurricane still off the coast, headed toward Bermuda. There's Bermuda right there. This is Teddy. Uh, still has an opportunity to strengthen to a category one hurricane before moving further off to the north and dissipating as it moves over colder water. So we'll have to watch that. And then there's another area that we're watching. Cluster of thunderstorms off the coast of Miami here has a 20% chance for development over the next five days. And notice how its movement will slide down toward Cuba and then eventually loop back up. And by then it could be a little bit stronger, or have a greater chance to become something tropical. So we'll watch that. If it does, if it becomes the next name storm, it will be named Gamma. We're in the Greek alphabet now. We've surpassed all the names uh, for this year on the list. We're looking at, uh, again, that moisture starting to slide further off to the north. For us, will remain beautiful, not only for today. Tomorrow as well, we start off with mostly sunny skies. I think we stay that way for much of the day. It won't be until late that clouds will start to increase in our area, and then that moisture will be drawn toward us. Now, it won't be on Wednesday. We'll have a mix of sunny clouds through the day. Thursday, pretty much the same. I think late Thursday is when we'll start to see an increased chance for the rain. We'll give it a 50% chance for now, 60% chance on Friday. Friday, 76 degrees for the high, and unfortunately, it sticks around right on through the weekend with 78 degrees on Saturday, Sunday, 80 for your afternoon high. By the way, fall starts tomorrow at 931, but it's already here. Don't go anywhere. We got much more for show for you coming up this noon right after the break.